And now here's a typical bag of microwave popcorn. This is Kroger brand. I prefer this brand. It's cheap, but it's uh, it seems to be better than some of the other more well-known uh, brands of microwave popcorn. This is how it's typically folded to get it to fit in the box. So as you unfold it, you notice there's a big clump of uh, kernels here, all stacked one upon another and such. And what you want to do, they don't tell you to do this, I'm sure they know this, is that you just want to press them. You want to press them so that they're pretty much all not on top of each other. They're sort of one single layer. You're not going to be able to perfectly get it, get that accomplished, but you're going to try. And once it's pretty much leveled out, okay, we've got this side up. Uh, microwave ovens vary, of course. Uh, this doesn't have to be folded up. If you're worried that it's not going to spin, you could sort of like fold them up a little bit like that. Uh, for my uh, microwave oven, it's two minutes and 40 seconds. Your microwave oven will obviously vary according to the cubic uh, space inside and the wattage. Don't expect every single kernel to have popped. There's going to be a few, but most of them will be popped. It's all in the magic of a single layer of popcorn kernels.